Yeah. Yeah, with some morning news. Let y'all know what's going on in the world. I'm going to let you know. I'm about to go live. Just a second. Oh, these wildfires are crazy over the West Coast. Y'all hear about this hurricane that's supposed to be hitting New Orleans. So if you're in the Gulf Coast, uh, Mississippi, New Orleans, looks like a Category 2 is coming. So definitely be safe out there. Um, know what's going on. Let y'all know what's going on with TikTok. Y'all heard about the president making him sell it to somebody in the U.S., blah, blah, blah. They're going to ban TikTok, all of this stuff. Well, I'm going to let you know what's going on with that. And then it's a... Uh, this is a lot. I'm gonna go live. Y'all ready? Let's go. It's the Ricky Smiley Morning Show. It's the front page on the Ricky Smiley Morning Show. All right, Rick Smiley Morning Show on the front page. News is being brought to you by America's Best. The right, your health is our priority. America's Best contacts and eyeglasses stores are now open to safely serve your vision needs. It's not just a better deal, it's America's Best. 25 after the hour. Eva, good morning. Good morning, Ricky. Good morning, everyone. And what a beautiful Monday. I'm Eva Marcel here with a quick look at your front page news. People in Oregon are being told not to leave their homes or drive due to the extremely poor air quality and smoke caused by the wildfires. Across the West Coast, 35 people have died due to the ongoing wildfires. Another hurricane is headed towards the Gulf, Gulf Coast. Uh, forecasters say Tropical Storm Sally will turn into a Category 2 hurricane and will hit near New Orleans late tonight. Meanwhile, two L.A. County Sheriff Department deputies remain in critical condition after they were ambushed and shot as they sat in their patrol car in Compton on Saturday night. Video of the incident shows a gunman walking to up to the police car, opening fire on the deputies without warning. The suspect is still at large. Meanwhile, the Chinese company that owns TikTok has chosen Oracle instead of Microsoft to take over its U.S. operations. President Trump threatened to ban the app in the U.S. if they did not find a buyer. And ironically, the co-founder of Oracle is a public supporter of Trump and hosted a fundraiser for him in February. Last, people are not only making TikTok videos during this pandemic, but apparently they're also listening to more music, Ricky. A new report shows that for the first time since the 1980s, vinyl records outsold CDs in the U.S. On top of that mm. vinyl list is the none other Michael Jackson thriller. Why am I not surprised? All right, wow. that's what's going on in news. Rock Teasy for Sheezy. Let's take a look at sports. Man, let's shout out to our sister Naomi Osaka winning the U.S. Open comeback victory. She made sure that Black Lives Mattered at the U.S. Open, man. She wore seven masks over seven matches, standing up for social justice, man, wearing the names of victims of police brutality. So big up to Naomi out there. Also, the Denver Nuggets force a game seven with the Los Angeles Clippers. They were down 19 points, come all the way back, man. Who would have thought? A lot of people got the Clippers of being an NBA championship, so we're going to see what happens. The NFL kicked off over the weekend. Dallas Cowboys lose to the Rams. They should have won that game. What's up with the Baltimore Ravens? Raven Nation blew out Cleveland. The Browns still looking like the Browns, man. They got all that doggone talent. Still don't understand that. Everybody talking about the Tom Brady comeback. Well, not really a comeback, but him with his new team with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Started off kind of hot, but that who that nation, the Saints, was too much for him. I still think Tampa Bay is going to be in conversations for the Super Bowl later on down the stretch as the season gets on. Yeah, I think it's going yeah, right. work out their chemistry. What's yeah, up, that's all. I was, you already said it. That's yes, all sir. it is. Working out their time and their chem chemistry. It's the first time, man. You can't judge. Tampa Bay by that first game, because I promise you, they're going to be fired. They get they are loaded over there. And once they Come get on, all dog. that together, uh, you'll see them in about three. Give them about three weeks. Yes, sir. It's coming. It's coming. So don't panic. Last but not least, big up to Cam Newton, man, the new quarterback of Tom Brady's old team, New England Patriots, man. He's doing a good job. Belichick got him playing smart and conservative, taking the, what the defense gives him, man. So we got the big victory over the Miami Dolphins, man. So we hope Cam continues to. What kind of juice. suit Cam had on that yellow suit? What that was? I don't the the Tweet Bird suit? What? Yeah, Gary, what was that? <laughs> Uh, who knows, honey? Some he found that there's 7-Eleven of people saw him there. So he just started to wear it to work. <laughs> Wait a minute, what? Damn. I say when they spotted him at that 7-Eleven, honey, these girls said, girl, what in the hell? Because he had on something weird then. So maybe you he thought about 7-Eleven, he had that suit on? Mm, he had found him a little illusion no. over there. Like a gas station or well, something. Yep. Mm -hmm. I better let Cam dress. Shit. Hey. He be Can't dressing worse than us. That's, a, that's the sharpest I ever seen. <laughs> that's there the sharpest I ever seen. 
Yeah, like I said, looking like Tweety under the sunshine. But anyway. Cam. He should have spent that money on, on, on his baby mama. Shouldn't get yeah, his she fighting and crying here to get sucking. her child support suffering, honey, with all them damn children. And he wearing yellow suits and things, child, looking crazy. <laughs> I guess. What does this suit have to do <laughs> with that? Looking like a Look school bus, man. honey. Yeah, uh-uh. Yeah, not a and, the children, and, and the children at home suffering. And they suffering. Uh, made you think about when uh, <laughs> Celia was coming, that little girl had yes. before Mr. Slop. She at home crying. Mm. She's trying to teach them children how to spell Apple. A-P-P-L-E. And he out here with, with what, Gary? Uh, honey, with a Tweety Bird suit on, honey. Here, this children suffering. And, see, and your dad out there looking like a damn clown, honey. Like, mm-hmm, that's nice. Hey, Cam, good game this weekend, Cam. Good game, big dog. I feel sorry. <laughs>